Our Chinese New Year Eve starts in the morning. It's all about getting ready for tonight's reunion dinner. In the old days, we start the preparation days before. But now, many families like ours order takeouts to save some trouble. On the last day of the lunar calendar, we need to greet the village god and the ancestors. Not only we provide food as our offerings, but we also burn gold papers or joss money to send the village god back to heaven for his annual report. Joss money are not allowed to be burned as a block. You need to fold them first and put them into the fire. After that, we have a few hours to relax before the reunion dinner. Buying scratches and lottery tickets has become a new trend during Chinese New Year. We too couldn't resist the chance to get rich. So we went out and got scratches for everyone. It's time to eat. The reunion dinner must be a feast. You need to have a fish in your menu. Oh, by the way, there is a dress code in attending this dinner. You need to wear something in red. After the reunion dinner, it's time to distribute the red envelope. Blessings are exchanged between the giver and the receiver. For good luck, the amount of money in the red envelope must end with an even number and must avoid number 4. It's time to test our luck for the new year. What can be better than gambling? And don't forget your scratches and lottery tickets. Only on Chinese New Year Eve. Kids are encouraged to stay up late. This action can bring longevity to the elders in the family. Once time passes midnight, New Year has finally arrived and I can go to sleep now. Happy New Year everyone!